Hello guys, in this video I will talk about spacing in LaTeX. As you can see from the table of contents, I will start with the length units, then continue with line break, horizontal and vertical spaces, and lastly line and parallel spacing. I won't cover spacing in math mode because we already shared a video about it, and you can watch that video by clicking the link above. Let's get started with the units. There are several units that we can use in LaTeX while setting a length. For example, we can use cm for centimeter, mm for millimeter, im for inch, and pt for point. In addition to these units, we can also use some uh, font specific units like ex and em. They are font specific in a way that they are affected when we change the font size and font style. For example, EX represents the height of an uh, lowercase x in the current font, and EM represents the width of an uppercase M in the current font. Later in the video, I will show you how we can use these units while setting some lengths. For now, let's move to line break. In this section, I already typed a, a sentence to save some time. Let me scroll down here. So as you can see the sentence in the line 40 in my text document and let me copy that sentence and paste another one in the line 41. When we compile uh, in the PDF document, the second sentence just starts where the first sentence ends. ends. Like it starts from uh, the same line. To move the second sentence to a new line, we can use either a uh, double backslash, as you can see here, and it the, it moved the second sentence to a new line. Or let me just copy this sentence, and this time let me just type new line. New line and double backslash do the same thing. And lastly, we can use H fill comment followed by break comment. These are three ways we can uh, break the line. Also, I just want to show you something before moving to the next uh, section. If I leave a line empty in my text document, for example, let's say that uh, line 44 is empty and I am typing another sentence uh, to the next line, it will create a paragraph. So my last sentence is actually the paragraph. Okay, so giving a empty line will give you a paragraph. Now we can move to horizontal and vertical spaces. Let me type here is some blank space, a short sentence. And I want to add a space between here and this. To do that, I am using H space comment and inside curly brackets, I am spe specifying the length. Let's say that it's one centimeter. And you can see in the PDF document, there is a gap, one centimeter gap between here and this. And to create vertical spaces, let me copy the sentence from Previous section and paste it here. So first, let's see the sentence. And to add vertical space, similarly, we are using H space comment, and let's set the length as one centimeter. And it creates a space between these two lines uh, with length of one centimeter. Okay, uh, you can do that for each individual line. Or you can do it for all the lines. And to show you, let's scroll down to the next section. To give a space between lines and paragraphs, you can use three comments. The first one is uh, parindent to create the space between, uh, like, by using these comments, we specify the amount of indentation for each paragraph. And we can use parse skip to create a space between paragraphs and we can use baseline skip for the distance between two consecutive lines in the same paragraph. 
to give you examples uh, I need to write a paragraph but instead of doing that uh, we can also use some package for example let's type use package blind text okay so we will be using blind text package to create some nonsense paragraph for example let's type blind text and here is our paragraph so it's just a nonsense paragraph in latin and to move that paragraph to a new page i am using new page command because it will be easy for us to observe the changes we are making okay and let me add another paragraph the same paragraph so that we can observe the changes now uh, to set a length we are using set length command it takes two inputs the first one is the command we want to set a length for example let's say par indent basically i am specifying the indentation for each paragraph uh, and let's make it two centimeter and as you can see the second paragraph has a larger indentation for the first line and it's now two centimeter it only affected the second paragraph because i set the length just before the second paragraph this is the second paragraph in the text document and this is the first paragraph okay similarly i can also uh, set the length for paragraph the space between paragraphs to do that let's use parsity comment again with two centimeter length and it created a two centimeter space between the paragraphs and lastly but similarly let's set base line skip so to increase the space between two consecutive lines this time let's make it one centimeter and for the second paragraph you see that now the space between uh, two consecutive lines is one centimeter and i think uh, that's all about space in the tech uh, thank you for watching if you have any question uh, please leave a comment and hope to see you in the next videos